Hello Android gamers, today I'm going to show you how to play Quake 2 on your Android device. First off, go to the Google Play Store and install this great free app. This is Quake 2 for Android, this is a source port. Come check it out here, thank the developer, and leave them a little feedback. First off, get this installed on your Android device. Next up, get Quake 2 the game installed onto your computer. Once you have them installed in both places, you want to navigate to the location you installed your Quake 2 game data. I put it in a nice easy to find location. I put it in C, Games, and Quake 2. This folder, the Base Q2 folder, is a folder that we're interested in. Once you've located this folder, plug in your Android device. We're going to open up our Android device here going to put it into the root storage, into the internal memory, the default location that will open up when you plug in the USB cable. And here we're going to create a new folder. Call this folder QII4A. Open this folder and here we want to copy and paste all the Quake 2 data. Once all the information is copied over to our Android device, we'll be ready to start the game on the Android device, set it up, and play it. Let's go try it out now. Now that all our game data is transferred over to our Android device, and we've got the game installed from here in the Play Store, we're ready to play the game. You can either open it from here or the link on your home screen. Let's start it up. Here's the Options menu. From here, you can change the default location where you put your data. By default, you're putting it into the internal memory, but you can change this here by editing this line. Next up, you can change your controls. I'm going to be using a Bluetooth mouse and keyboard. You'll need rooted super user access to do that. I'll select these two. By default, you'll have on-screen config buttons like this. You can move them around and get more. Show hide them by clicking that button there and dragging them up. And this is what you'll see on the screen. You can adjust it any way you like. Once you've got it all set up to your liking, you can start the game up. You can also up the graphics if you want. I'm going to be doing 32-bit color. Let's start the game. Here's Quake 2 on Android. Classic ID software. This little part at the beginning will give you a good kind of benchmark comparison for your own device. start it up. Now I'm running this on my HP touchpad. That's a dual core device with one gig of memory. Now this device is about two years old now, so to give you a good point of comparison, any dual core device will run this reasonably well. This same author has apps for running Quake 1, Quake 2, Quake 3, Return to Castle Wolfenstein, and even Doom 3 on Android. I've got videos on all of those. Check them out. Really incredible stuff. These old games had some really great level design, lots of different ways to play them. Good replay value. the shotgun.
I used to play a lot of Quake 2 multiplayer, had all the mods and all the crazy skins, the Simpsons, all kinds of crazy stuff. Lots of fun. It was a great game for modding. Had a great modding community back in the day. Some great nostalgia value in these older games. Really nice to see them all running well on Android. Classic game innovation, they would shoot at you while you're dying. These guys look like Barrett from Final Fantasy VII. Like a white Barrett. Thought maybe that was the inspiration for the character. Well, there you have it. Quake 2 runs really well on Android. Check it out for yourself. Here's the little part that runs at the beginning. Always love running this part for you. Please like the video and subscribe to see the latest. Retro gaming on Android. So much fun to play these classic games. All right. Just gonna play a little more. Game had some really classic weapons. You guys will remember the rail gun, the machine gun, the shotgun, all classics of play. Of course, the grenade launcher, one of my personal favorites. Used to dominate online. And there we have it. Great level design back at the beginning. Please subscribe to see the latest in gaming updates for Android. Check the description for all your classic Quake games, Doom 3, and Return to Castle Wolfenstein, all on Android. Thanks for watching, everybody.